I, I love I love pretty much every superhero movie that has come out. Yeah. What, good or bad, I still love them because just for the simple fact that, you know, like when we were younger, we dreamed yeah, of these did. movies coming out. We did. You know, we always thought, wouldn't it be cool if Spider Man came out, you know, in a movie or X Men movie came out? Da, or da, da, Venom. Or Venom, which is coming out very soon. All right. Uh, yeah. Good segue. Yeah. Speaking of Venom, <laughs> we're going to be talking a little bit about the Venom movie. Uh, they just announced that a Venom movie is going to be coming out October 5th of 2018. 18. Which is next year. Oh, next shit. Next year. Yes. For some reason, I thought I was 16. Yeah, no, no, no. Very, like, Again, very soon. And and this is very weird. And I have something to talk about, too, about this. Because, um, you know, we 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 love Venom. Oh, yeah. Venom is probably one of our most favorite Spider-Man characters. Just because he's just so... Beloved. Beloved. He's beloved. You know? <laughs> just because he's very... He was very... Uh, out, he was like the anti, uh, anti-Spider-Man. anti Yeah. At the time, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, and And he was very rebellious. You know, he did everything... Spider-Man couldn't. Yeah. Every every uh a moment that Spider-Man, you know, thought he had the upper hand, Venom had him. Yeah. You know, I mean, it, it was just one of those things. It was it was a cat and mouse game. It was, yeah. Tom when, and Jerry. when Venom uh first came out, Tom and Jerry was it? Shout out to Tom <laughs> and Jerry. <laughs> 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 um, so yeah, uh you know, it, it was one of those things where, you know, they when Amazing Spider-Man 2 came out, <laughs> Uh, they, they they announced that they were going to do a Venom movie and then also a Sinister Six movie. Um, yeah, so we were like, oh my, like, this is kind of cool. At the same time, I was like, well, how are they going to pull this off? There's a bunch of villains. You know, hey, man, how are they going to pull this off? The easy, <laughs> yeah, the Darren's wings just came back out and <laughs> shit all over yeah, No, I didn't. You got I'm your not. fucking wish. No, but yeah. apparently, because of the, of the whole... Uh, I don't know if you remember. I th- we talked about it on the podcast a long time ago. I can't remember. Um, mm-hmm. Call back to the podcast for a long time ago. <laughs> we talked about the Sony email hack. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember? Mm-hmm. And they, they hacked a bunch of emails, and, and a lot of people were saying a lot of derogatory things towards other actors and people and bad stuff, really horrible stuff. But shame on you. Shame on you people out there being so racist and ugly. Yep. Um, but... Out of that came also plans that, you know, they they were going to do these things. And because of that happening, they were like, all right, we can't do these no more. But everybody knows. The hack fucked it up. Yeah. No. Uh, uh, pretty much. All right. Pretty so much. what we do is we find this guy who hacked it. And, we but, kill him. But also, Get rid but of him. Also, on that note, we also got the initial emails between Sony and Marvel trying to team together for, for Spider-Man Homecoming. Yeah. Right, no, but still, yeah, I know. I just kill him anyway. <laughs> Fine, John. <laughs> so, be, uh, you know, because of that, whatever, it, it kind of got put on the back burner, and uh, you know, it was one of those things where I, I thought it was it was gone, right? And uh, apparently, just out of nowhere, Sony decided to go ahead and announce a Venom movie again. October, I think it was October fifth, two thousand eighteen, yeah. which was like. Oh, what? Like, it's like... Wait, hold on. Let me just October? think about this. It's already 2017, so that means next year? Like, what? So they've been doing this already. So they've they been probably been. thinking about this stuff already, right? Okay, mind you. The other thing... What do you know, David? What, I'm, I'm getting to this. Okay, I'm trying to make a connection here. Uh-huh. There's also another movie out uh, coming out very soon from Sony. Sony Pictures. Uh-huh. Called Life. Have you ever seen, have you seen Traders for Life? That's Ryan Reynolds one. Is, yes, uh, Ryan Reynolds, uh, Jake Gyllenhaal, Jake Gyllenhaal. Uh, and there's a couple other people. people. Yeah, a couple <laughs> other people. <laughs> I love how we had the same reaction. <laughs> yeah, a couple other people. <laughs> uh, and do you, you get, I guess, the basic premise? Yeah, 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 yeah. They go up in space and and they find something, you know. Like a flower. And the, 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 the initial, like a flower. the initial trailer that I saw was of uh, a dude like you know secluded in a in a room and they're looking on and he finds a petri dish of or he puts you know the whatever he found in a petri dish and he's he has his hands with some gloves and looking at it in a like a containment unit and it uh they don't show up but he's like oh you know <laughs> it, you know it's like, oh my god 
you know, we gotta get this. We can't let this, you know, get out. And then, Help uh, him! Help uh, him! We're not supposed to open it. And everybody's just like, ah! ah! <laughs> right? <laughs> That's kind of what it is. <laughs> the initial trailer. That's what it was. Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> the initial trailer, everyone was ah, ah, ah. <laughs> right? Oh my god! I'm not wrong. <laughs> I'm not wrong, right? Yeah, I know that's what it was. <laughs> Just and I agree with you. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, um, so that trailer happened, and I didn't, I didn't really think about anything. I think another trailer came out, and I was like, man, that movie looks good. Like it reminds me of Alien. You know what I mean? Yeah. The initial Alien movie. Um, and then somebody, uh, I guess online had, had noticed something that <laughs> in that trailer that, uh, that there was, there was, there was a shot here. <laughs> Look at it, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And again, it says hashtag life movie is le- legit from the, the trailer. Uh, uh-huh. and, um, and then there's another, another shot here. <laughs> look, look very closely. If you're on YouTube, look very closely and lean over same shot, right? Okay. Pretty much. Yeah. Right? Okay. Same guy. You see him? Okay. Just doesn't have a flip phone. Uh, a flip phone, do mind it, you. Do it again. Oh, okay. Same same lady here. Danny Trejo in the there. back. Danny Trejo. Well, this screenshot comes from Spider-Man 3. What? Yes. What's Spider-Man 3? Spider-Man 3. Tobey Maguire Spider-Man 3 where Venom came out no now wait this is just a theory okay in the newest trailer of life of the movie life they show a little bit more of this alien yeah mind you it looks like a tulip and it goes after whatever what if this is a symbiote and this is a secret prequel for the Venom movie. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I'm serious. Like, I, I started thinking about it. I'm like, hey, this could possibly be. But, but Ryan Reynolds wasn't, he was an astronaut. Yeah. All these people are astronauts in this movie. John. I didn't know. Stick with me here. But he wasn't, he wasn't, David. <laughs> he was, he was a hit man. <laughs> That's Deadpool. That's Fox, okay? Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> it's two different companies. Okay. <laughs> what if, like, again, they did the same thing with 10 Cloverfield Lane. Okay. And we didn't know what it was about up until the trailer hit, right? They did the same thing with, uh, oh, my God, what was this other movie? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, man. I can't remember the other movie. Come on, David, remember. There's a couple of other movies. <laughs> I can't remember. But, mind you. Okay. This movie, Life, okay, was also directed by Paul Wiernick. And Rhett Reese, which directed, I um, mean, which wrote Deadpool. Oh, they yeah? wrote Deadpool. Oh, yeah. Huh? But they also wrote a draft for Venom at some point okay. in the past. Well, you, I mean, we saw Logan. They showed an extended video of, of life at Logan. Did you watch it, Dad? Did you? They did. Yeah, they did. I saw it. Yes. Okay, but what does that matter? <laughs> it was a flower. It came alive. It grabbed him by the arm. Okay, but what if it's not a flower? It's a symbiote. Jim, Jake Gyllenhaal doesn't belong in Marvel, okay? Hey, you don't know that. What if this has nothing to do with that? Again, this is just the prequel. He is in Prince of Persia. This is the fan. It, it's just a theory. It's a, it is a theory. It's more, more than likely it's not even possible. But all signs, like, it, it just... It lines up in a certain way where it could possibly be. They even asked the writers directly, is this a Venom prequel? And, what they say? <laughs> and they're like, yeah, yeah, oh, it's a Venom prequel. Nah. You know, we're, we're but, being, but they, they were like doing it jokingly. Like, we're being shafted is what it is. And, and they were like, yep, this could totally be a Venom prequel because, you know, the alien thing up there comes down to Earth. With an and, you know, it, it, okay. it, gets, it gets a hold of who knew. I need names. But I need the, the names of the astronauts on there. If anyone's called no, no, no. Flash the, Thompson. The, the, the thing with this, though, the thing with this, with, with the Venom movie that they're planning, is that they're 
they're planning it in a way where it has no connection to Peter Parker. Uh, yeah, which is very weird to me. Why? That doesn't make any it, sense. It, ve- the, the Venom He's symbiote, Venom, in, Venom himself, has so much to do with Peter Parker and Spider-Man. Yeah. That, uh, again, th- this could possibly be, but probably not like it. It's, it's fun to, to theorize and... Well, that's a huge-ass have... theory for those two pictures. Yeah. To almost look identical. It, identical. And, but, it, it, again, it, it's it's very likely to uh, for, for studios to recycle footage like that. It is. Yeah. And I'm not I'm not being like, you know, oh, it definitely is. But, it's, it's again, it's a fun thing to theorize with. And it, it kind of lines up in a way. But I doubt that they plan that far ahead. I, no, you know what I mean. No, man, we got we got we got shafted on Rogue One. Really, you think so? Yeah, because they didn't. Those they they can't. You know what I mean? No, I don't. The Knights like, of Ren, that that whole. Oh thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got shafted. See, well, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't believe in that. See, uh, w- when I did see Rogue One, I after the movie, I was like, well, I guess my theory was wrong. Yeah, it, was <laughs> like, well, it wasn't ours. It was that. It was, yeah, yeah. Uh, whoever. Was I was like, yeah, I guess the theory was wrong. I mean, it seemed like it lined up perfectly, yeah, though, right? Really, really, really did. So, who knows? Maybe it could be, like, I don't know. Maybe, like, Force Ghosts or something? I, I don't know. <laughs> Weirder things have happened, dude. I know. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> but, I don't know. So, so I mean, that's a oh, cool... Man. That's a cool little Venom theory. Um, I, I... It would be very cool if it was true. Because, again, it would be a movie that nobody would expect. Yeah. You know, but... I don't think so. So then, who, who, who's Venom's nemesis? I don't know. Carnage. Well, he, he, I think they're going to lead into, like, the whole Venom... Maximum le- Carnage. No, I think they're going to do the whole Venom Lethal Protector thing. Maximum. Where he's just, like, this vigilante. And he goes into, like, Either Hell's that, Kitchen and he fights Punisher. Yeah, that too. Yes. Either that, or they might just do the, the whole Flash Thompson thing. No. Like, start him out with Flash Thompson. Because, honestly, that's kind of, like, the most recent... And the most popular at, at you know in recent time to be Flash Thompson, um, it would make the most sense. I still don't see how they could do a Venom movie without the connection to Peter Parker and Spider Man. So what they do is they do what McFarlane's doing to Spawn with Sam and Twitch. So Sam and Twitch being Venom and Spawn being Spider Man. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. They're, they're, I mean, because they're, they're gonna spin off Sam and Twitch to something else like all by themselves, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. They, they, yeah. They, Supposed to be dark and gritty. Yeah, so dark and gritty is everything. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I, I they're gonna do something like that again. I thought it was a cool little thing, a cool little neat little uh, you know fan theory that they put across it. That I I thought when I read it and I saw everything, I was like that kind of like it, it could possibly you know coincide. Yeah. But I don't think the studios thought that far ahead. I thought I I think that they were just like well let's just reuse footage of this and they're pulling you know, our chains. What it is? You know, but yeah. So. Anyway, Venom movie coming out October 5th, uh, 2018. Next year. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty close. I wonder how they're going to do that. I don't know how they're going to pull that off. But mm. So is it going to be a kid? Mm. <laughs> going to be a grown-ass man fighting a kid later on? <laughs> I'll, I'll, okay, all I want from a Venom movie is for them to make them make him really built. Okay, like so huge. we get Tobey Maguire to be Venom. <clears throat> Bringing it full circle. Yeah. <laughs> Beating the shit out of the little kid that took his job. <laughs>